Hey everybody, we're playing some more Pokemon. We just got to the Lost Hotel. We got ourselves an Electrode. We're still looking for a couple other Pokemon. You're trying to get in my way of having a bit of fun, aren't you? I ain't gonna let that happen. Okie dokie, bud. Alright, Slater? What do you got? You got Felon Spores? It's a weird Pokemon. Imagine having a single Pokemon and you're like, yeah, Dunsparce. That's the one. Only one. All of these Pokemon everywhere. Dunsparce. Alright, Slater is a man of uh, integrity and style. Alright, Slater. I was just trying to find peace is all honest. Okay, well, oh, hey, we got our Flaffy evolving. That's pretty cool. And I do think we have the Ampharos site, so we can Mega Evolve Ampharos if we wanted. Probably not going to, but we can. All right, we got ourselves an Ampharos. With a little smile. I like Ampharos. Ampharos is a, is a real homie. Yeah, I want Thunder Punch. I'll get rid of Thunder Wave. I don't need Thunder Wave. There we go. Okay. Uh, wait, can I break these? Did I get rid of the Pokemon with Rock Smash? Yes, okay, cool. That's what I thought. I'm like, I don't know how else I'd punch through the wall. Okay, there's nothing in here. What about inside of this one, maybe? Maybe, maybe, maybe there's something inside of here? Hey, yo. Got ourselves a dread plate. It's probably enhances ghost types, right? I would assume. Right, let's see, made new Pokemon, maybe? Hey, yo. Litwick. Pretty cool one. Definitely one of the cooler, coolest Pokemon, actually. I would say cooler, but no, it's the coolest. A Fire Ghost is, like, one of the best typings, and, like, I really like Litwick's design, too, especially Chandelure. So. Definitely in contention to one of those maybe final Pokemon on my team, for sure. I, I really like Litwick and Chandelure, so... Oh, hey, crit catch. Okay, cool. You absolutely love to see it. Alright, Litwig's data was added. While shining a light and pretending to be a guide, it leeches off the light force of those of who it follows. Spook. Alright, let's see. Anything inside of here? Boom. Nothing. It's not for skating, but I've got a trick to teach you. Try using this move, would ya? Okay, fling. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, let's keep moving. Hey, yo, Ponyard. Pon... Okay, I don't need you, though. I've actually already caught one of you. Very cool Pokemon. Another very, very cool Pokemon, but... I have caught it, so I don't need it. Trash can. Alright, well, I'm gonna have to fight this guy inevitably. Hey, Magneton. And hey, actually, that is all of the Pokemon, actually. We have caught Magneton, we caught Electrode last episode, we got Litwick, we already have Ponyard, and we have Klefki. So we just have Rotom, Trubbish, and Gardevoir from the shaking areas. After we catch this, so that's pretty cool. There is my phone. There's my phone in my pocket. Let's go ahead and give it another ball here. Oh my purchase. Why does why does Ashley furniture it keeps sending me that it's charging me again and again and again? Why are you doing that? I'll just throw another Pokeball here. I guess I'll just check my banking. Hmm? 
I don't know why it keeps telling me. Alright, just stay in the ball, por favor. Magneton. Why won't you just stay in the ball? Alright, um... I probably wasted a good, like, $20,000 on this single Magneton, which is very wonderful, and I actually got most of my Pokemon killed. Um, so not very cool. I don't particularly appreciate it. A linked cluster forming of several Magnemited discharges powerful magnetic waves at high voltage. Well, you're going to go ahead and go on my PC and be there for a very long time. And our sand dial is evolving, which is also pretty epic. Boom, boom. But I probably will have to get out of here and actually go back and heal. Because I'm not using, like, five revives. Like, that's also expensive. I'd rather just run back. Alright, we got ourselves, uh... Crocorock, or rock. Yeah, Crocorock, okay. Rock, a rock, a rock, a rock. I'm like, I'm, I don't know how many rocks there are. Do I have an escape rope? Is that like a thing? Is that a thing that we got? Let's go and use the escape rope. Let's get out of here. I need to go and heal. Um, let's also use a repel. All right, we're back. Um, I went ahead and put away Ampharos. I went ahead and grabbed Staravia. Let's go ahead and do it. My buddy was putting on the whole bad guy act, so I copied him and ended, copied him and ended up like this. Oh, I'm sorry, Jackass. That's not very cash money. Have yourself a stunky, huh? Interesting. Well, I'm not gonna be here for very long, huh? All right, we got our Stormy level 62. The level to 30. Brawdaunt. Okay, we'll go ahead and uh, do a little Thunderbolt on this bad boy, huh? Thunderbolt. Zap. Start me to 23. Nah, we don't need Whirlwind. E, please forgive me. Bro, it's alright. Like, it's, not, it's not a big deal, honest. You're good. Um. Okay. I'm like losing myself. Okay, go this way. Both my mom and my old man are veterans, and my big bro is an ace trainer. I just couldn't stand to be all goody two-shoes like them. How boring can you get? See, but like, what's wrong with being a goody two-shoes? I feel like the connotation of being a goody two-shoes is only given by those who are not. But if you are one, why does it matter what they say? You know what I mean? Eh. I never got people like that. Is this just because they want to be different? Why do you want to be different? Like, just... Why can't you just be content to who you are? I don't understand, people. Why do you have to try to be something you're not just because it's something different from everyone else? Alright. Who you got next? Another one? Alright, well, we're gonna go ahead and uh, surf it again, I guess. Alright. There we go. Pretty easy. Pretty easy. Fungus to level 37. Arabia to 24. Don't care about losing, I just love the thrill of battle. And that is wonderful. Alright, let's... Okay, I was like, can I break, can I break through the back? Bonk. Alright, a protector. Interesting. 
Uh, if we can just break through. See, why would anyone go through the other one? Well, I guess if you already got the item, you're coming back through for some reason, but still. It's a trash can. Alright. Is. Is this it? Am I missing something? Hold on. Smoke ball. I think that's it. I mean, I think we can come back here when we have, like, skate skills or something. I don't know, but whatever's here, you actually can't do it right now. So, yeah, I, I guess let's get out of here. And we'll come back later when we have the skate skills. So for now, I don't want to use another one. So we're actually, we're on our way now. What's nice about windmills is they can move by a breeze and in a pinch by people or Pokemon. I hear your future is secure if you join Team Flare. Alright, we are now in Dendamil Town. Okay, so we got a lot to explore. Welcome, Moo Moo Milk. This is 500. Um, I'll take one. I think I already... Actually, I probably shouldn't. I already have a Moo Moo Milk. I just want to make sure I keep some on me because it seems like in every game there's one person that takes um, drinks for TMs. Like lemonades and waters and Moo Moo Milks. Um, so I want to make sure I kind of keep a couple on me so I could get those TMs when the time comes by. Okay, let's head over here. Can I help you? Yes. I need more Ultra Balls because I wasted so many. Let's buy about 41 of those. Do I need anything else? Probably a couple more Max Repels. Alright, so that's good. Let's see. Oh, I'll see what the other guy sells, but it's only one guy here. Um, I can change my clothes, but I still haven't really bought any. It's kind of funny. Um, okay, so that's the exit to somewhere else. Okay, so we'll just come back down here later. This is this is the way to get out of here. Why, hello, David. Hey, yo. How have you been? How's your journey going? You see, when I was younger, I visited many different regions as well. I met many kinds of Pokemon and noticed how each place has its own distinct flavors. So I really came to enjoy trying new foods as I traveled. Because, I'd, because of my adventures, I'm an expert on the cafes all over Kalos. Come on now, Dexio. I'm going somewhere with this. Do you remember the Poke uh, Pokemon Lissandre mentioned in that cafe? Wonderful. I knew you would. Kalos' legendary Pokemon is called Xerneas. According to material I've read, those who saw it were overwhelmed by its power. They were only able to say that the Pokemon is resembled the letter X. Apparently, this Pokemon can control energy, gives life to plants and Pokemon, and it makes them full of vitality again. Whatever do you think a Pokemon that amazing could be now? When Kalos' legendary Pokemon loses all of its vitality, it goes to sleep in a secret place. I don't have a clue where it could be. The writings that mention it are also around a thousand years old, so they aren't much help. It would be absolutely astounding if you found it, David. Maybe I'll look into the legend a bit. If I find something, I'll let you know. Haha, uh, it would be a thrill if you found it indeed, but your journey is yours and yours alone. I want you to enjoy yourself and do whatever you'd like. Ooh. Um, is the professor gone already? I was hoping to have him have a look at my Pokedex in person. Oh well, I can still get my Pokedex evaluated at a Pokemon Center's PC. Anyways, I'm heading off to look for the Pokemon in the Frost Cavern. I'll fill up more of my Pokedex. Alright. Windmills rotate just like the Wheel of Destiny, so rotation battles are windmills. Ah, I mean destiny. Mamoswine is amazing. It lived 10,000 years frozen in ice. Right, where is all... Whoa, this is bendy. Okay, well, let's go house by house. Let's not uh, overshoot ourselves here. Alright, Leo. So bad guys are like, we'll take over the world, but I think it would be really hard. Okay, I don't care what the guys is to say. Ah, you have Pokedex. How many Pokemon have you found on the mountain? 39. If you find 70 more, I'll give you something sure to delight. Okay, noted. This guy, come back when I have more. Um. Okay, windmill. Um. 
Oh, facade. Okay. Facade. Jesus. Facade. Facade. All right, shorts kid. I appreciate it. One of the ways that Pokemon trainers make their strong Pokemon strong is to use TMs. But do you have the TM for Energy Ball? Wait. No. Okay. I. What was the point of that conversation? Was she gonna give me something if I did? Anyway, what's in this house? Okay. How many similarities do you think Tyanimo and Maltham share with each other? I don't know, man. You guys got anything? You got any items to give me? All right, whatever. I don't care. I want items, brother. Not talk. Okay, um, wait a minute. If I go up here, okay, I go up here. Where does this take me? Frost Cavern. Okay, so that takes me over to Frost Cavern. I don't want to go there yet. Let's see where this takes us. That just takes us back down. Oh, that's right. I am the move deleter. Okay. Okay, move deleter. Very cool. I don't need that now, but I might need them later. Man, um... Okay. Alright, I don't need any Pokemon to actually remember any moves. Alright, but noted, this house... This town is kind of important. There's a lot of things we can come back for. Okay. When I'm working in the fields and plowing the soil, I feel like part of nature. Alright, big root. Alright, cool. So we kind of explored the whole town. When we're done with the Frost Cavern, we're going to go down that way to get out of here. But as far as that's concerned, we're kind of done. Okay, well, I guess that's where we're also going now. So let's go ahead and head up into the Frost Cavern. Um, let's see. I'm confused. Oh, Route 15, Dendeville. Okay, so actually, before we go there, there isn't actually anything new to catch, but there is one thing that we do need to do. Yo, where's the Poké Center for this place? Does this place not have a Poké Center? Oh, I literally was just here. We need to take an Eevee with us, because if we evolve an Eevee down, the, uh, down near a rock down there, we can get something. So, let's go ahead and just put Staravia in the box for a second. And let's go ahead and grab an Eevee. I'll not deposit. Yeah, let's grab one of the thousands of Eevees that we caught. I think they're all like level 20, right? Um. Alright. Let's see. Okay, cool. Yep, so, like, look, if I'm here, I might as well get the Glaceon. Um, it's gonna be a pain to come back here later in the game and, you know, blah, blah, blah. So, hey, look, I'm going. I might as well get it done, right? So, anyway. Burr, it's so cold. You came here just the right time. Let's warm our bodies with vigorous Pokemon battling. That sounds weird. Um, Ross. <laughs> He's got a big Brava, though. Alright, I will take you out of the sky with a big old surf. I could probably use an electricity, but I'm gonna do that, too. Woo! That's a... I was... I, I went off pace for one second, all of a sudden a video plays. Um No, we don't we don't need this. No, we don't need that. Alright. Is this cold I feel coming from snow and ice around me from the shame of my defeat? Lol dude. Okay, so that's a waterfall. It's a mammal swine. Something wrong in the frost cavern, mammal swine. 
Are you headed to the Frost Cavern Trainer? This mammal sweat in here usually can't get enough of giving people rides in Route 17, but these days it seems to be worried about something in the Frost Cavern to give rides. So maybe it's tensed, okay. And you are? My name is Trevor. I'm researching the distribution of Pokemon in the Kalos region at Professor Sycamore's request. I see, so that's why you're walking clear out to- you're walking clear out to the- uh, It seems concerned about something. Okay. Alright, so just- Hey, wh what are you going to do, Big D? I'm going to prepare for my expedition. I'm just going to head right in, bud. I'm kind of already ready. Um, okay. Stop right there, youngster. I'm going to paint your portrait. Let me guess. You got a Smeargle. Of course he's got a Smeargle. What else would a painter have? All painters have Smeargles. Alright, we'll give it a good old surf here. And... Um... Wait a minute, there are Pokemon here. Okay, for some reason I thought there was no Pokemon here. There are, it seems like there are different Pokemon on each... Okay. I told you not to budge an inch, so there are Pokemon here. Is there, like, anything on the sides? Apparently not. Okay. So, wait. Outside. Okay, there's nothing on the outside. But there are first floor. Okay, we've got... Ooh, okay, so no, no bike, no rollers. We do have quite a few things to catch. Hey there, you look pretty strong. I'd be missing out if I let you go without battling. Ace Trainer Cordelia. Doublade. Oh, that's a cool Pokemon, actually. That is indeed a very cool Pokemon. Um... I'll just hit it with the Surf. It might not be effective. I think Thunder might have been, but... It's alright either way. The levels are coming up. Level 46 already. Cool. Rock to 31. Oh, that was close. Just a bit more now. What a one. Okay. Hmm. Is, it not Is there nothing here? Alright. We got ourselves a Bergmite. Very cool. Let's see, can I, can I not kill it with a power gem? Okay, that was super effective, so we very much did kill it. Fair enough, I guess. Alright, we found a dire hit. Let's see, we gotta check both rocks just in case. Okay, nothing in that one. Now let's see what else we can find. Ooh, a bear tick. Oh, okay, I was like, can we find this lower evolution? But we can. Oh, and I didn't bring my... Oh, man, I didn't bring my... Um... Thingy. Um, let's hit it with a... Thunderbolt. Let's see, we'll just kill it. I didn't bring my combi with me. Alright. There we go. Got it into the yellow, at least. Yeah, I'll, I think I might have to go back to my combi. Um, but what we'll probably end up doing is... We can do that after, it's fine. And we could also face a couple hordes while we're here, so... Oh, you, that was a weird little move thing that he just did. Alright, another Ultra Ball, another day, huh? Bear tick. You'll love to see it. You're mine. Here we go. Level 63. The, they love the cold seas of the north. They create pathways across the ocean waters by freezing their own breath. That is weird. That is very weird. We got ourselves a battle. 
Rain or snow, it matters not. An ace trainer does not let anything get in his way. An ace trainer is always elegant, whatever he does. That's what it means. Defines an ace trainer. Okay, bud. Ow. Can you go away so I can, like, go upwards? Oh, never mind. Uh. Okay. Alright, let's see if we can get anything new. There we go. A jinx. That is something new. Here we go. Now, I think a dazzling gleam will definitely not kill it. Almost did though. All right, let's go and throw a ultra ball out of here. Do as we do, what we usually do. First one. Hey, look at that! First one. You love to see it. Cool. All right, another one in our Pokédex. It wiggles its hips as it walks. It can cause people to dance in unison. Alright, so we skirt here. Get ourselves an ice heel. Alright, let's go down maybe here. Okay. Hmm. What about the middle? Do something like that. Okay, and what if we go like this? Okay. Both my father and mother were hikers before me. It runs in the family, you see? Okay. Alright, Delman. What you got, bud? Ooh, that's a pretty good Pokemon, actually. A Recolanth or whatever you say it. Re Re Relic Camp. Um, I think a Surf would be best. I know it's a Water Pokemon, but a Thunder I don't think would be effective either. So. There we go. Alright, I need to get to that rock, because Eevee's going to get way too high. I need to get to that dumb rock. Ooh, that's a cool Pokemon, though. A Rhydon. Look at that. Alright, people are pulling out some actual cool Pokemon nowadays. All these other people are lames, man. This guy's got a ride on. That's cool. I've been defeated. Whatever shall I do? My identity crumbles before me. Okay. Solves another ice heal. Probably won't need it or ever use it, but it is with us. Ooh, walk right into battle. People say it doesn't matter if you win or lose, but of course, everyone wants to win strategy. What strategy? I have trust in our Grumpig and Hariyama. That's all we need. Alright, by Eon and Wolf. Brains and Brawn. Alright, one's got a Sumo Wrestler, the other one's got a failed Sumo Wrestler that... Yeah, alright, anyway. Um... Let's go ahead and... Man, I could surf him, but I'll definitely kill Clauncher. So let's just do a Thunderbolt on the Grumpig. Clauncher will go ahead and Crab Hammer on the Hariyama. I think that'll work too. Is that gonna kill it? Why do you have to hit the Clauncher, dude? Hit the Starmie! Alright, you're gonna make me angry. I'm gonna pull up the fungus. Man, I should have just surfed it up. Let's go ahead and Giga Drain on the Hariyama. Alright, Grumpig, you're out of here, bud. Nice, right, Starmie level 64. Fungus 39. Clear smog. No, it doesn't need clear smog. Crocorock to 
belly drum. What? Okay, interesting. Don't know why I did that. Fair enough. Do another Thunderbolt. That wasn't particularly a good idea, taking its half of its HP away, but eh, what am I to say? I swear, man, Clauncher is never gonna get, never gonna evolve because I keep, keep getting it killed. Yeah, it's over. Yep, we're done. Uh, you're done. All right, Fungus. Here we go. I need to get to that stupid rock. I'm trying to see if there's any difference in the Pokemon that we find. It doesn't actually look like it. Okay. Got ourselves a Fungus Among Us. Put a Among Us meme right here. Thank you. Um... All right, let's see. We gotta go fight that guy anyway. Skirt. What's this? Are you trying to thwart my attempts at love? <laughs> Eat this karate chop. Oh, chill. Yahoo! I finally meet eyes with someone in this freezing cave. Here we go. Dwebble is also evolving, so we'll get a lot of evolutions going here, which is kind of cool. I just I need to get down to that basement so I can evolve our Glaceon. But it'll be cool. We'll actually, like, that's like three evolutions so we can get another three going. Alright, we got ourselves. Your Dwebble evolved into a Crustle. Very cool. Alright, let's see. Which Pokemon are dead? Alright, we need to revive Croc Rock and Clonid it. Alright, but we, th we do have to still catch a bunch here. Not you, Beartick. Not looking for you, bud. I'm gonna go ahead and definitely run from you. Because I don't need ya. Alright, ooh, a Max Repel. That's kind of not that useful, but useful nonetheless. Just want to make sure I didn't miss anything. Ooh. Okay, bang, bang, yep, there we go. Ooh, more battles. It's probably it's probably hyper potion the star me here. I don't want to have another situation where I die again. Hyper potion. Oh, it doesn't look like this guy wants to fight me though. Let's make a bull so we can rest. Oh, okay. I wasted that revive. Those two revives. Oh no, I can't feel my toes! Lost. Sorry, man. Anything in these rocks? Hey, super potion. I knew there'd be something in there. Interesting. Doesn't look like this is getting me anywhere, but look, we we be shifting. How do I get back to dry land? Dude, how do I get back to land? Am I stuck? Oh, I think I could. Yeah, okay, I could go back like this. I'm like, geez, man. I've I've fallen and I can't get up. Okay, there's not one, nothing there that can save me. Okay. Hmm. 
Interesting. Okay. I'm like kind of zero braining this, but. Oh. Could just do that, I guess. When it's cold, it's best to have a battle to warm up with. Alright, Brent. Ooh, he's got a probo pass. Very cool probo pass. Very cool. Wonder, will, will a Thunderbolt, is that like effective against probo pass? Probably not. Oops. Okay, earth power. That should hurt a little bit, but not too much. Later with another Thunderbolt. Zap. I love that juiciness. Alright, Starmie to 65. Crustle grew to 35. Eevee to 28. Getting a cold sweat from putting on such a terrible performance. I need to get to that stupid glacier because Eevee's going to keep evolving and it's going to be hard to get it to a high enough level later. The secret to karate is good circular movement. Alright, Kenji. We got Girder. That is a cool Pokemon. I do like Girder, actually. That is one of the po I have a shiny Girder in Pokemon Go. But I can't find a friend who has another sh their own shiny Girder to trade with me. Or, no, shiny, not Girder. The one right before Girder. Um, not Timber. I don't know. Point is, I have one of them, of Shiny, and I can't find a friend to trade one with me. Ooh. It's really cold in here, isn't it, Big D? Is there something going up, going on up ahead? Hey, leave that bomb of stone alone. This bomb of stone is a fine specimen. It's absolutely brimming with energy. The more we agitate it, the stronger its snow warning ability becomes, making the snowfall even more viciously. Furiously. Hey, you know what? We're going to continue this next episode, guys. Thanks for watching.